My name is Bobby Ferguson. My name is Daniel Bibby. My name is Vanessa Walter. I'm at a minor for the party. We're at Virginia Commonwealth University. I'm a mechanical engineer here, I'm a senior, and I'm the leader of my senior design team, which is the Moon Buggy Project. The Moon Buggy Project is a project that NASA puts on each year. They give you uh, design specifications and a time limit to complete the project, and every year they go to Huntsville, Alabama, to their space station. They uh, design a course like the surface of the moon. The course uh, has a lot of uh, craters, you know, sand pits, gravel, similar to what we're going to see in the moon. A moon buggy is a human-powered vehicle. We create essentially like a tandem bicycle in which you're sitting down on four wheels. It has independent suspension all around, and it would actually work on the moon if you were to account for the gravitational pull of the moon. Lots of considerations. Terrain, flexibility, durability. In essence, NASA's putting out feelers to say, we'd like engineers in this sort of manner. Can you compete? How else do you find out whether or not you can find engineers around the world who can take the next stride into the next generation and the next level of efficiency, if not by to challenge them in simple ways like this? This particular buggy is actually an improvement from last year's buggy, which was actually really good. Once we get out to the park, we'll be able to ride it. There's quite a few curves, and it's kind of a little rough in the walkway, so be able to get to see what it can handle and how it can go. In the classroom, we do a whole lot of number crunching and calculations and just critical thinking, but this gives you that hands-on experience that you don't always get in the classroom. It really makes you understand the difference between calculating something on paper or drawing it up in a, in a CAD program and then actually implementing it into the real life working model. When you come to a university or you continue your education, it's not just about books. You can actually take what you learn in school and, and actually use it. People take the designs that we make and they take from them, maybe not the entire design, but they maybe help them build their project. You can really take your knowledge and change the world, you really can.